Today's article, NASA Asteroid Warning. Spacecraft is to slam into asteroid in planetary defense mission. Tom Fish of Express UK reports this from NASA. NASA will slam a spacecraft into an asteroid as part of the, Dra the DART project, D-A-R-T, designed to save the planet from extraterrestrial Armageddon, the team's senior scientist has revealed. While we know that we have a potential very bad asteroid coming towards us in, uh, if I remember correctly, about 2035, 36. So that's not just, it's not too far away. And they have to very quickly work on this because they'll have to save humanity for something like this from an asteroid or a comet Earth impact. That's asteroid Bennu that I'm talking about. But back to this article. Earth is a const in constant danger of a cataclysmic event, an er I would say an Earth extinction event, with the existence of an estimated 1,000 near-Earth asteroids capable of causing devastation in a continental scale, and NASA tasked with protecting the planet from such an apocalyptic asteroid strike, believes it has come up with an audacious solution. NASA is readying its double asteroid redirect test, DART for short, it's an ambitious plan to slam a spacecraft into an asteroid at the speed of 13,500 miles per hour in order to redirect it away from Earth. That's the mission's project scientist uh, explaining this. Their mission is to push it out away from Earth. Experts estimate an impact of the size, the object, the, the object the size of one that exploded over Chelyabinsk, Russia, in 2013, approximately. 55 feet in size, takes place once or twice a century. Impacts of larger objects, such as the KT impact extinct, extinction event, are expected to be far less frequent on the scale of centuries to millennia. This mass extinction event is believed to have wiped out the dinosaurs by triggering a mini ice age. However, given the current incompleteness of the near-Earth object catalog, an unprecedented an unpredicted impact such as Chelyabinsk event could occur at any time. Let's remember that the Chelyabinsk asteroid, the meteor strike, was not even caught by any space agency. It just came in on its own. Uh, and at this ever-present and unpredictable danger, it has driven NASA to attempt the new planetary defense system. Dr. Nancy Cabot of DART Coordinated Lead told the news agency that uh, the damage possible from an asteroid depends very much on the size of the asteroid. The DART mission is demonstrating technology that could be used in a planetary defense kinetic impactor mission, which is designed to be the most effective for asteroids in the size range of roughly 100 to 500 meters in diameter. She says if an asteroid of this size hit the Earth, it would cause large-scale regional devastation. The DART spacecraft will launch in 2021 and impact the smaller asteroid of the binary asteroid Didymus system in October 2022. Currently, the smaller Didymus asteroid, 160 meters diameter, orbits the larger Didymus asteroid, 780 meters diameter, every 12 hours. Dr. Chabot said the spacecraft will impact at 13,500 miles per hour, that's 6 kilometers per second, and predictions are that the 11.92 hour orbit will be changed to about 5 to 10 minutes because of the impact. This change in the orbit can be measured from telescopes on the Earth. Since DART is the first test of the kinetic impactor technology, applied to a target that resembles the type of asteroid it would be used for, the results of that test will teach us a lot and make us better prepared for the next steps in any overall planetary defense uh, system. DART is a highly cost-effective way to test this technology because it cleverly uses a binary asteroid system, enabling telescopes on Earth to evaluate the effect of the impact. Quote, this is very cost-effective approach to do this test, end quote. Okay, so the little uh, um, Didymus goes around the bigger Didymus, and you're pushing it from about 12 hours um, rotation to half an hour. What happens if it uh, 
pounds into the biggest, bigger Didymus asteroid and somehow get, uh, they both get pushed along somewhere else where nobody can understand where they're going to go to. Uh, this is this is mind-boggling. Uh, what I'm afraid of is that they're going to crash it into the the little one's going to crash into the bigger one, and make more pieces, or somehow alter its direction, the bigger the bigger one's direction, and then uh, when it, where is it going to be going to? Towards us, or where? Uh, anyway, this is on Express UK, and I'll leave a link below for you for this. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece. In Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.